Welcome to the unboxing of the Huawei Sport Bluetooth Headphones Lite. Uh, this came as a free add-on with the Huawei uh, Watch GT2e. The MRP is shown as uh, 3999 and these are uh, wireless uh, headphones. Now let's just uh, do the unboxing. So it's mentioned here that you get different ear tips, a USB charging cable and a Huawei carry case. So let's So this is the packaging, we have a warranty card up front, okay, so I think I opened it upside down, so this is the Huawei uh, Sport Bluetooth Headphones Lite. This is the carry case that was mentioned. The ear tips are in the carry case, so is the charging cable. And these are the headphones. On this side is the manual and the warranty card. Let's just check this out. Yeah, this is a detailed user guide, quite thick. Looks like due to the multiple languages and a fairly thick uh, warranty card as well. Quality looks quite good. There is the Huawei marking and this has the plus minus marking for the volume controls as well. Okay, and I think this is the charging port. Yeah. And this looks to be a micro USB port for the charger and this could be the power switch. Let's try it on. Yeah, that is the power switch and let's try to see how it pairs. Yes, that's fairly fast. Yes. And there we have it. The uh, Huawei uh, Bluetooth headphones are paired to the phone. That was straightforward. Let's take a bit of a more of a detailed look at the Huawei AM61 uh, Bluetooth earphones. Uh, these come with uh, Bluetooth uh, 4. Uh, they're not, uh, you know, uh, as per the latest Bluetooth 5, they're still Bluetooth 4. And um, the charging port uh, is uh, micro USB. Huawei claims a 
charging time of about uh, a, st a playback time of about uh, 11 hours uh, I've had no problems in getting my typical workday through with this I've been using this as my daily driver uh, in taking office calls and so on uh, one of the key advantages is that this uh, pairs really well with my laptop uh, which is a HP laptop and um, I'm able to talk take uh, calls uh, using these headphones uh, uh, when using tools such as Skype for business and uh, Microsoft Teams uh, earlier headphones uh, some of the wireless ones that I tried had uh, in fact crashed the laptop. No such issues with this. Uh, let's now see how this pairs with a Windows 10 laptop and turn on the Bluetooth. Go to add a device and ensure that the device is in pairing mode. You can see the So there you can see the AM61 is now connected. Now once this happens, if I bring up the audio options, so we have uh, multiple options here. So one is the hands-free audio and the other is the stereo. So when we use the hands-free mode, uh, we will also get the microphone. The stereo would only be for a listen-only mode. Coming to the audio quality uh, for voice, I find it to be excellent. There's no uh, problem with voice. Uh, coming to the surround effects, if you are playing a YouTube video and there is surround effects, the separation of sounds and the surround effect is also excellent. What this um, headphones lack or the primary con is the bass. Uh, the bass uh, is on the lower side. So other than that, uh, in terms of the regular usage for voice calls, uh, for phone calls uh, uh, directly with your phone or laptop based uh, business meetings and calls. This is uh, perfect for those scenarios. It's lightweight, uh, not really heavy and um, sits pretty snug in the ear, not a problem at all. And at the back, uh, there is also an adjustable uh, hook so you could actually tighten it around your neck so it doesn't uh, sag around and the two drivers also lock magnetically so yeah overall a, a good uh, pair of headphones uh, not really for the music enthusiast who loves a lot of bass but for uh, usage for business meetings phone calls uh, and of course the surround effects so maybe for movie watching uh, apart from the music part uh, this is a good buy. Thank you.